Hi everyone, it's Graham here with another review for you of this uh, self-catering accommodation which is in Morecambe. So we're in Morecambe and if I just pan round you can see that we're right on the seafront here. So you can have a walk down the promenade, down into Morecambe itself which is that way. And there's space for one car, one car to park just here and I believe there's space around the back as well. Uh, but this is a four storey house, although you can only see three storeys here, there's a basement. So we'll go and have a look inside. So here we are, it's called um, Little Gem. Little Gem. And as I say, it's self-catering accommodation. Now it, it describes itself as very quirky and it certainly is very quirky. Um, as I say it's on four stories so first of all what can I show you first? We could go upstairs or we could go downstairs into a basement kitchen but first of all we'll look through here. So you can see all the, uh, it's almost like an antique shop really um, oh, little bits of lovely furniture. And artwork on the walls. I mean, it's incredible really. There's things I, I've not seen yet. Every time I look around I see something new. Look at that old poster there for Midland Railway. Amazing. So yeah, so at the, this is the back of the house now. So you come down the hall, we've just come down the hall from there. And uh, at the back of the house is this little toilet. Look at that lovely floral uh, design on the basin. And the same on the actual toilet itself, amazing. As I say, I keep seeing things what I've not seen before. And then round here, there's a little snug. What they call the snug. That's got, that's got a little television in. It's got some games down there, as you can see. Lots of books. I mean, if you were here a year, you probably wouldn't read all these. But yeah, <laughs> lots of books. And some videos down there. Just look at this. That's amazing. <laughs> it really is. That lovely mirror there. And that's through to the, um, there's a window here, into the living room, which I'll show you in a minute. But, oh, look, look at this. I've just found this. Just seen this, look at this chandelier. <laughs> oh, if we can get it. Wow. And that, yeah, this room's really nice and warm actually. And uh, there's patio doors out there onto a little balcony. I don't know whether you can see that. And there's a table and chairs there. And that's the garden down there. So if I think. I think we'll go downstairs into the into the basement kitchen and, and I'll show you that. So we're coming back now through the hall. There's the front door. Now if we go down here, now these stairs are quite steep, so you have to be careful. Lights come on automatically as you can see. And this is good. There's a little under the stairs bit there with a little table and a bureau. And in here is a kitchen. Modern kitchen. So you've got uh, 
one of these halogen um are they halogen not sure anyway one of the hot plate things electric four 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 rings hob uh, lots of stuff there I mean we haven't brought any of this this is all this has all been left. There's some coffee there, look, and a coffee cafeteria thing. Look at these. Look at that. There's a sink. And, yep, we do have a dishwasher, which is good news for me because that's normally my job. So that's excellent news. Lots of pots and pans. All nicely look new these do don't they? Yeah. Big slow cooker there by the looks of it. Uh, there's a little table there, sort of breakfast table. Um, big fridge freezer, and that's my phone keep going off. Apologies for that. And a, a bureau there, like a what's that? A Welsh dresser type thing. So although there's a lot of uh, quirky old-fashioned antiques um, it's also good for uh, for modern technology because there's a there's a fantastic oven there look and a microwave not sure what we've got here an espresso oh some uh, coffee things coffee things for your coffee machine oh yeah an espresso coffee machine there look try that later on so yeah um, and this is a dining area again look at that grandfather clock is it a grandfather or a grandmother I'm not sure not sure of a difference but yeah look at that looks like there's a sewing machine down there uh, it's got gas central eating Uh, there's a television in the dining area there, look. So you can sit and have your dinner and watch telly if you want to. And outside here, there's a nice little garden actually. Yeah. Some more sitting out area, lots of bit of shade there. And not actually been down there yet, so it looks like it might be a little summer house or something down there. So I might go and investigate that in a minute. Yeah. It's lovely, isn't it, this? And uh, what have we got in here? I think there's a toilet. Yeah, another toilet in there. And in here, I think, is the boiler. Yeah, a Worcester boiler. Uh, gas central heating, as I say. That's another toilet there. So, yeah. Wow. It's just amazing. Absolutely amazing, this place. I can't can't believe it. What we've got in here? Oh, it's like a little... I suppose this would be the pantry, originally. So, a few bits and bobs here telling you about the various uh, takeaway places, the looks of it. And there's some food there. We, as I say, we haven't brought this. We haven't unpacked yet. So, there's also this is a big bag full of sugar, uh, tea bags, oxo cubes, even some baked beans, chicken soup and tomato soup which have been left for us. A couple of flasks there, look. Wow. HP sauce, tomato sauce, sarsen's vinegar, even some Kellogg's oats, look. And some cereals. Amazing. 
Right. So yeah, some more books here. Look, look at these cookbooks. I bet. Yeah. Yeah, cookbooks. So you won't be short of uh, ideas for cooking meals. I believe there's a barbecue out there as well. I'll have to go and have a look at that. Yeah, so this is it. This is a kitchen anyway. So we'll go back upstairs now and we'll go and have a look at the bedroom. So the stairs, this is the front door, look. The stairs are immediately as you come in the front door. Again, quite steep. I think this is quite an old house. More books, look. Lots more books there in that little bureau. And some magazines. A hoover, if you want to hoover up while you're here. And this is the master bedroom. Again, in keeping with the property, there's a nice little uh, iron bedstead there, but it looks like a king size. and built-in wardrobes so plenty of hanging space and out the window you can see Morecambe Bay and they've even left you some uh, some uh, binoculars here yeah. <laughs> so you can uh, can look at the the view out of the window how lovely nice little easy chair there It's like somebody's, it's like you, you're living in somebody else's house really and they've sort of left it for you with, with bits and bobs in. It's really nice. Look, tea's, tea's made. So we can make ourselves a cup of tea in the morning. Amazing. Kettle. And the ensuite, which again is lovely, isn't it? Double basin there, his and hers. I think I'll have the right hand one. And Pauline can have the left. Uh, shower. Shower. And <laughs> I've just seen this as well. Another chandelier. Wow, look at that. Amazing. We've got a chandelier in here, yeah, there's a chandelier in here as well. And one near the window there. It's lovely this is. Right, we go up if we go up another floor, uh, we come to the top bedroom. Oh there's a little radio there, look. Can have a radio one in the morning. Is there a television? No, there's not a television in this room. So, yeah, yeah, so we'll go up another floor. Look at these, look at these pictures. Go up on there. Isn't that lovely? Right, yes, upstairs. I keep getting way late. Oh, that's a nice view out the window, look. Upstairs, another steep set of stairs up to the top floor. And up here we have two single beds. And a telescope there for you to look at. And a little seat, look. So you can come up here and bring a cup of coffee up and sit and look at that that view out to sea in Morecambe Bay lovely I love these little ornaments look at that yeah so telescope there a pair of binoculars there is a television in this room, in this bedroom, 
Not sure we'll be watching too much television in bed though. A few more books here. If you haven't, uh, you know, if you manage to read all the books downstairs, uh, you've got some uh, some more books up here. <laughs> and in here, this is right on the top floor. There's a, a washing sink by the looks of it. Washer. Oh, that's a dryer, is it? And that's a washer, or vice versa, I'm not sure. And another shower. And a view out the back. Over the garden. Yeah, what a lovely place. Ironing board for you. Yeah, so this is it. It's um, oh, we haven't seen the uh, the sitting room yet, have we? We'll go and have a look at the sitting room. We'll go downstairs. Bear with me while I I'll switch this off while I go downstairs. It's a bit a bit steep. I've just seen that on the way downstairs. I've just seen that. Look at that. Ship in a bottle. Another ship in a bottle there. And a picture. As I say, I keep seeing things that uh, I've not seen before. Every, every corner you turn there's something new and you think, oh look at that. So here we are back in the hall again and uh, just to the right of the front door is the lounge. Lounge, sitting room, whatever you want to call it. There's a table there uh, which is out looking out to the front window. More little knick-knack. Look at that. That uh, saucer and cup and saucer there. Lovely. More little knick-knacks. There. Lovely little picture there. It's like, uh, it's like going to, back to your grandma's house, isn't it, this? Lovely, though. Three-piece suite. Nice coffee table and fireplace. Hello, look at that clock, Art Deco, Art Deco clock. Wow, my god, beautiful bureau with the uh, glasses. And a decanter, wine glasses, another lovely picture there, some lovely flowers. And that's through to the uh, little snug which I showed you earlier on. Another bureau. Artwork on the walls. Doesn't that look lovely? This is a fantastic place. I can remember having a fireplace like that in our front room when I was a, a boy. Many, many moons ago. Uh, big TV look. Not sure what that is, 50 odd inch I suppose. And it's got a DVD player underneath it. Yeah, so you've got everything you need here. Absolutely everything. There's a sort of welcome, welcome book. Welcome to little Jim. Telling you all that you need to know. So yeah, lots of information there. Different um, things. Oh, it's got Wi-Fi. That's good. Not to mention that yet, yeah, Wi Fi. And uh, these are all the pubs, I think, what you can uh, visit while you're here if you fancy having a meal out. Lots of different pubs you can visit. So there's a visitor's book. We shall be 
telling him what a fantastic place this is in the visitors book. Lots of people been by the looks of it. Uh, yeah, so this is it. It is called the Little Gem. Little Gem. And um, I'll put a link actually on the description where we got it from. I forget what the company's called now, but it's like a holiday company and you book it through them. Uh, but the chap who um, who actually owns the place, very, very nice, very friendly, uh, phoned him just before we came uh, for, for the details of a key and where to get the key and everything. Um, that's in a key safe outside, so you can just come. He'll give you a number for the key safe and then uh, you can get in and have a lovely, uh, lovely holiday. So yeah, it's called it's called Little Gem, and it's uh, it's in Morecambe, which is on the uh, west coast, isn't it? Near near the lakes, near the Lake District. So uh, plenty of opportunity to get out in the Lake District if you want to. And uh, I can, uh, you know, I've only been we've only arrived today, but I can recommend it already because you can see just what a fabulous place it is. We're going to have a fabulous time here, and it's lovely. It's ideally placed for the seaside, look at that picture. So ideal is placed for the seaside and uh, the lakes. So yeah, we're gonna have a nice time here. So this is it, it's called The Little Gem, or Little Gem, and uh, it's in Morecambe. And I'll, uh, just have a look at the link at the bottom there. There'll be a link to the, uh, uh, to the webpage where we found it. And uh, it was, it's, it's been lovely, this is. It's absolutely lovely place. Well decorated, nice and warm. Uh, the heating's on, so it's nice and warm. So yeah, little jab. Try it out. I recommend it. Okay, that's it for now. Cheers, and uh, we'll see you on the next video. Cheers for now. Bye.